Welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an exciting topic to discuss that could potentially change your financial perspective. We're diving into the world of the PNC Financial Services Group. Get ready for some mind-blowing numbers and insightful information. Let's jump right in. First up, let's talk about some key financial ratios. The PNC Financial Services Group has a price-to-earnings ratio, PR of 8.82 based on the trailing 12 months TTM data. This indicates that investors are paying $8.82 for every dollar of earnings the company generates. Now, looking ahead, the company's forward price-to-earnings ratio, PRFWD, is 9.57. This suggests that the market is expecting higher earnings in the future. Speaking of future expectations, let's take a look at the price-slash-earnings-to-growth, PG, ratio which stands at an impressive 0.81. A PG ratio below 1 indicates that the stock may be undervalued relative to its growth potential. Moving on to profitability, the PNC Financial Services Group boasts a return on equity, ROE, of 12.6%. This shows how efficiently the company is utilizing shareholders' investments to generate profits. Additionally, the return on assets, ROE, is 1.1%, demonstrating the company's ability to generate profits from its assets. Let's talk about earnings per share, EPS. The current EPS stands at $14.60, indicating the company's profitability on a per-share basis. Looking ahead, the PNC Financial Services Group is expected to experience an EPS growth of 10.96% over the next five years. This positive forecast suggests potential future earnings growth. Now, if you're a dividend investor, you'll be delighted to know that the PNC Financial Services Group offers a dividend yield of 4.66%. This means that for every dollar you invest in the company, you can expect to receive a return of 4.66 cents in the form of dividends. Or what is the same, collect $5.75 in 2022 for each share you have. Let's shift our focus to the company's operating margin, which is an impressive 70.8%. This indicates the efficiency of the PNC Financial Services Group's operations in generating profits. Furthermore, the company boasts a profit margin of 32.7%, reflecting its ability to turn revenue into profits. Now, let's take a quick look at the company's profit and income evolution over the past five years. The PNC Financial Services Group has shown a positive trend in its profits and income, with the last two years demonstrating particularly strong growth. Now, for all you investors out there, let's talk about the average price return of the PNC Financial Services Group over the last 52 weeks. The stock has seen a negative return of 17.71% during this period. Remember, past performance does not guarantee future results. Lastly, let's look at the company's market capitalization, which stands at a whopping $51.40 billion. This reflects the total market value of the company's outstanding shares. And there you have it, folks. A comprehensive breakdown of the PNC Financial Services Group's key financial indicators and performance. As always, it's essential to conduct thorough research and consult with financial professionals before making any investment decisions. If you found this video informative, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for more exciting content like this. Thanks for watching.